Good morning everybody. Welcome to Serena M Design Knitting Crochet Embroidery Weavings Arts and Craft. How you all doing today? I would like to welcome all the new subscribers and old subscribers to my channel. Thank you so much for sticking in with me and uh, become my subscribers. I uh, just want to show you I got this because I'm doing a lot of tester. This is a mosaic one. So I've done all that part and done the testing the pattern, whatever not. So I decided to make um because winter now nearly over, but um I need uh warm clothes, so I thought I'm gonna make myself a sweater, but I like free form, scrub, really scrub kind of sweater for first time. So, look at what I made. It's mixed between crochet and knitting. That's show who I am. So, what I do is I... I didn't even measure. I just uh, like... Um, I want baggy. And the good part, I want baggy. So, I make this long chain. This long chain. And I start attaching, attaching all the, the sample that I make. So all sorts of samples, some of them crochet, some of them um, knitting. Like this one, a uh, patchwork uh, for lock cabin. I'm learning how to do that, but didn't finalize. So that's become a sweater. And the um, mosaic. So yeah, all bits and pieces. So this is a bits and pieces, free form kind of thing, crochet thing that I've tried to create. I don't know what I tried to create, but it look nice. So this is nice also mosaic. And uh, and I'm not sure what this one called. I forgot now. So yeah. So I just join them together and whatever patches left over, knitting and crochet, knitting and crochet back and forth, back and forth. So at present moment I'm knitting. Uh let me see. The yarn is here. And back and forth, back and forth. So it's very simple kind of um knitting. Some of them got um Need one per one. Some of them is just gara stitch. Some of them is stockinette. So all mix it up. So at present moment doing gara stitch. Or stockinette. I'm not really sure yet. But I think just uh, just knit right through. It's nearly 4 o'clock in the morning. I'm not even sure what millimeter this one i think this is five millimeter five millimeter uh circular needle so i'm really pumped i cannot sleep when i got this idea of mine gonna be a brilliant idea i have to do it like keep me awake because if i lay down also, my head still thinking about the the sweater, the jumper, so I can't sleep. So my so I just need until I get really tired, then I go to bed. And uh, it doesn't really matter. Um, you know they got like. You know the stitches, like you pick up the stitches from the uh, knitting to uh, the bump, the bump from the knitting. It show up on the, on the, on the jumper. It become like a design. I saw that in Pinterest, that's what gave me an idea. See, I saw them, they're doing a crochet one. And different kind of stripey. Kind of thing that I'm thinking that I got a lot of this, uh, you know, sample thing that I do. Why don't I combine them together? This is what I'm saying. When you testing the, 
the knitting or crochet if you got a sample don't throw them away uh, cast them off and um, make it a jumper if you don't want if you think that you don't want to this in yourself try it for your children kids will love it because it's abstract So yeah, I just can't wait until it finish. It's gonna take three days, I think. So this is gonna be part two. Knitting and crochet. Mix both up. At present moment, I'm just um got to stitch them. Excuse me, sorry, I got the yarn in my mouth. So uh, I'll show you one more time what I had intended to do. I got a piece of yen. I'm using a scrap yen. So I'm going to finish it all my scrap yarn on the floor. Going to yarn store tomorrow to buy some yarn. Hang on, I nearly finish. I'll show you what I try to do. It's just a patches of patches of a sample. If you got the, you done a lot of tester, you know the tester sample, right? Please don't throw them away. You don't want you can post it to me. I'll make it a jumper out of it. I'm really serious. I can uh, give you my my address. Or P.O. Box number. See, this is what I mean. See, this single crochet here. So, Larry B. has a, has a design um, element. So, look at that. How pretty is that? Don't you all reckon he's pretty? So, a big patch. It's just like uh, 
crazy crazy scrappy um, jumper so yeah that's what it look like on this side it can be back or front doesn't really matter this one big one see that patchwork This is mosaic, mosaic knitting. So it could I look like somebody bend down here, and you know, like people standing. So yeah, I got uh two more to do. This one to attach. So, I attach with the sing, uh, half double crochet. So, yeah. I'm gonna make myself a cup of coffee soon. Uh, I think you all night time there, hey. We morning coming up. Uh, early morning. It's 4.30 in the morning. So. Normally I go to bed at uh, 6.30. Wake up at nine. So, yep. Yeah. So, yeah, just um, you see that? Just um, knitting away is a gara stitch. Join them up together for a space so it can grow and grow. When I got the idea, I have to do it because if not, my brain like at all hurt like really bad, really really bad. So if I do it, then after that, like tension, it go away. When I got the idea, I have to put it, implement it. <clears throat> so I saw the scrap and 
um, my uh, tester all over the place and I'm thinking like, I clack them up I said I'm gonna turn this into a jumper because I saw about two weeks ago in uh, Pinterest um, the designer I forgot the name already they're doing all crochet uh, stripey and everything like that so I thought ah, give me an idea I said I know what to do and I even uh, I done the coil basket I stopped here for a second and let me see all the patterns so this is a coil basket it's very easy based on crochet um crochet rope you don't have to buy a rope this six mill approximately six millimeter uh, crochet rope so it works so i do this in the daytime and i'm knitting in the night time so yeah look at the pattern isn't it wonderful so yeah just create something i have to um create things but this one very easy this is based on the graph it's pretty 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 easy i'm serious if ugly person like me can do it anybody can do it man seriously i'm just kidding about the ugly one <laughs> just joking okay the pattern based on the graph uh, when you exactly uh, exactly what you see what you get example if you see uh, here three white or no color you count three and then one X X is one white uh, one black example X is represent one black so you just three white and then you coil it eight times you coil, 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 eight times, and then you just uh, use the needle and put it in and put it out, and then do again next. See, this is represent three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And that represent one, eight coil. This represent two, one, two. And this represent two, one, two. So yeah, I just stack it up and then I change the thing. And I also got my uh, bo um. This one gonna be another uh, boga basket. Also, um, this is also uh, um, tapestry crochet. So yeah, I'm a bit busy at present moment. I got a lot of things to do. This one will go wider, uh, flare out, then coming in again. <clears throat> so yeah. Meanwhile, I'm gonna finish my uh, concentrate on my uh, jumper first. I really, really need one jumper. So I'm going to invest three days of my time for jumper. Now I know how to do the coiling basket from Senegal. Inspired. So I figured it out how to do the pattern. As soon as I know already, I'm say I'm I'm happy. I have to teach myself. I always learn new thing every day. That's what I like the most, so my head doesn't get hurt. I have to do something productive every day. I force myself actually to do something productive every day. One thing I'm 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 not lazy. I'm eager to learn, and I will put dedicate myself and time to teach myself. 
how to do it so yeah I have this policy in my mind all the time if they can do it why can't you what's so special about them and why you not special so it just take time because they also take time to, to learn they learn from young to make a basket from their grandmother you learning from YouTube so it take time to learn I always tell myself that anything anything I want to do I give myself a chance so yeah I know they're special because they're very very beautiful beautiful make beautiful beautiful basket but you can make beautiful beautiful basket the same thing too but you have to um uh to change the plan a little bit because you have to put in mind material you use are totally different than what they're using but the outcome gonna be the same thing if you do it properly so that's what I always tell myself I always tell myself that so yeah I'm not painting anymore because there's no competition anymore so and I have to buy paint at present moment I don't I'm gonna invest my money on wool and uh, I bought Hessian want to do the punch needle I've got a lot of project in my mind so because the um, you all call Joanne, we call Link Craft or something like that, or Hobby Lobby. We got Link Craft here, and that one special, half price, from ten dollars go down to five dollars. So I just grab ten meter to keep it. I know each time I buy by Bob out, and uh. In the end, I know need to utilize for something. So that's what I do. So yeah, guys, I'm just knitting away. I'm just uh, eager to show you all um, yet another learning curve. Um, this is my own pattern, my own design, my own idea. I haven't seen anybody do like this before on YouTube. Knitting and crochet join them together. And uh, using scrap for the sweater or, or jumper. We got jumper here. So yeah. That's what it is guys. If you like this channel please hit subscribe button and like button. I highly appreciate it. I want to uh, grow my channel. And I hope I... I um show or give you all an idea you all got a lot of sample everybody have a sample that they keep somewhere that don't know what to do turn them into a jumper so yeah this is a crochet i don't know what i mean i think this one's supposed to be a basket that i learned before so yeah it looked like a turtle to me so yeah i thought i toss in there and uh, so a piece of artwork that's it guys uh, thank you so much for tuning in to my channel I highly appreciate it this is called crochet knitting uh, crazy scrappy uh, jumper okay have a good day see you later guys god bless